minus me and you On the road with a couple of tunes in a car for two Hey darling You know we're gonna have a really good time Driving in the middle of the night when the stars are bright Pack our bags and get in that car real far Let's get out We can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand We are two crazies from South Africa That's Frick and Pietru we decided to chuck it all and we are now living and saving full time on our new home, Sisu. We have the main up, but it is basically just our own wind taking us forward. We're about an hour away from Nassau. Look at that, it's like a mirror. You see the clouds in the, reflected in the water. And this is how it looks. That's the main sail. <laughs> and this is seven meters deep. So guess where we are at Lantis City. And we are like rich people. We've got a berth here for tonight which worked out way cheaper than us getting day passes to come into Waterworld with the kids. But this is now very fancy spansy. Okay, so that was a rush job to get tied to the dock here. Yeah. But this is not what we expected at all. This is just not on. So we are in the process of trying to find alternative, but we're right in the entrance. So all the boats, the wakes will make a hell of a wake. And oh, doesn't sound positive, but this is all the wakes are coming in here. So this is the entrance into this marina. So everybody's going to be in and out. And they charge you 500 bucks for this. I don't think the captain is going to be happy. Yeah, so there you can see all the... That's the main channel. So everybody going up and down there will just create havoc inside here. Yeah. Okay, so they do have another slip for us. Obviously for almost double the price. Which we did not budget for. But um, now we get to come inside which was the original plan and um, yeah so let's just hope we have a better slip this time because the whole idea was for these two to go to Waterworld or we don't want to spend half a day walking there so um, we wanted to be close to the action but look, look at this beautiful boat Oh, here's the guy there. So it looks like behind this fishing boat. Can't see any. Oh, here's numbers here. Oh, he's just chatted to those guys. So we are looking for number 27, which I think is way further in. This is going to be our dock, which is way better. And look at our neighbor. We formed a similar boat in the SVGs. Sisu look a little bit small. 
But look at that. So it's small catamaran between these huge boats. Let's check those out. Atlantis Paradise Island is home to the largest open-air marine habitat in the world, representing over 250 marine species. The kids, and of course even the Milani, love the water slide that runs through a lagoon using a transparent tunnel. They got to see reef sharks and nurse sharks from a very extraordinary vantage point. There was just so much to do and see. One day is definitely not enough, so book yourself a couple of days when you go by. We are now here in the Berry Islands. We just anchored there for the night. Flows, conch bar, and restaurant is just by, uh, just behind here. But we could not get there last night. The wind was just not right, and we got stuck in the sand a little bit. So, trying to look for a good anchor spot. But look at we've got the two sails, wing on wing. And we're going to go for a while in this direction till we hit the reefs on that side and then we will turn and follow the reefs so then we need to jive this big big guy to the other side and there's a lot of sailboats coming i can count one two three four five five sailboats coming that way so Going to get crowded here. Oh, six, seven, seven. It's going to get busy here in the Exumas. I think everyone is targeting for the Exumas. But yeah, tonight we're on our way to Fort Lauderdale to drop our guest off and then we'll be back too. <laughs> 
<laughs> we just saw this spot here, so we decided we're going to anchor here. So that's Hofmanski. There's a blue hole just around there. That's Falki, and I think that is White Key over there. There's a couple of boats there and anchor. Doesn't look too deep. Well, it is not. It's it's 2.7 meters deep. And um, so we saw another Leopard 45 on that side. We might go inside high there. But yeah, I think with the dinghy we have to go around, or maybe around here might be a walkway to the Blue Hole. But there's also mangroves there. And uh, that side is the open Atlantic Ocean. So we cross, we now anchored almost in the open Atlantic Ocean. How's that for a for a thumbnail heading? Clickbait. But yeah, don't worry. The winds is now that direction, but it will turn more or less that direction, so we will be fine. Um, tomorrow morning we will need to go pretty early to Bumimi. It's quite a far, far stretch. So let's go check out the blue hole. The Milani is all on her own on the boat. Uh, we just got to work and we are on our way to the big blue hole. It's more than a hundred meters deep there with a lot of pirate skeletons at the bottom apparently. But the big attraction is to jump off a seven meter cliff into the hole. So we tied the back to the tree over there so that the nose is pointing into the wave. Otherwise the waves will just slam sand on, normally you put the anchor down there, but if there's a tree branch, much better. So now let's see. Looks like this is the trail. And since I'm tall, I'm catching all the spider webs. <laughs> it's not good. Oh, see. Oh my golly gosh goodness Oh my Are you on camera? Enjoy Enjoy <laughs> Okay. I thought it's going to be much higher. It was a surprise to eat the water. <laughs> Go. Much fun was had by both the kids and the grown-up kids alike and there he even disappears into the abyss. We're going to get battery out of battery very soon. But let us go out here. It's pretty, pretty treacherous. The road. And I've got a beer. I can prepare it. And this is where you jump. It's pretty high. Don't drop the camera. Okay. 
Uhr, doch ich, die Bad. Okay. How was that one? Wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. It's always nice to have a wet and salty sailor. <laughs> oh, oh, this is still there. This is called a fish. Yeah, but we didn't have that one. Come on now. Yeah, come on. So we anchored here between Little Sterbki and Big Sterbki, I think. This is where the cruise ships came for their day passes and both of them are leaving now. That one is just, just about to leave the docks. You can see it's moving. So it's going to be quite quiet. There's a million umbrellas and there's a water park there. So they come here every day and stop there. But the wind is now from that direction, obviously, because we had anchor and it will shift all away. So we've got protection, protection. Then around four o'clock, it will come from this direction. So four o'clock, we need to go out and then start moving for the mummy. And then, yeah, then it's back to the US of A. Sadly, the family visit came to an end. Last week dinner, and then there was just the two of us again on Sisu. We missed them dearly. Oh